today we have a reprieve. The air has cooled down, so take advantage of this opportunity to meditate as much as you can, because we have very little time. As the Buddha said, you live to a hundred years, and still it seems short. And during that hundred years, it's doubtful that it, during the last ten or so years you can do much in terms of physical things. But until your last breath, you can always do something good with the mind, if you develop the habit of doing something good already. As you get older and older, and if you haven't been doing it, it gets, it gets harder and harder. So you've got the opportunity right now. Remind yourself with each breath that comes in goes out, you've got the opportunity to do something good. It could be an act of generosity, an act of virtue, developing more mindfulness, more concentration, more discernment. Because some things require a lot of build-up, but then it's a, a moment of sudden understanding that makes all the difference. So whatever little bits and pieces of time you have to meditate, to take advantage of them. If you have long patches of time, try to take full advantage of those too. It's too often there's a tendency that if you've got an hour to sit, you give the mind 55 minutes to kind of gradually glide down to the topic. You'd have five minutes of real concentration at the end. Well, there's no need to glide. If you know where the mind likes to settle when it meditates, when it finally does get into concentration, you know what the breath is like when it's well settled, we'll go right there. Part of the mind will say, well, I don't know what to do with myself once I'm there. Okay, then the next step, of course, is to protect it. But give yourself something, give yourself something good to protect. This way you make full advantage of what little time you have. The opportunity to be a human being doesn't come all the time. You've got it right now. The opportunity to meet the Dharma doesn't come all the time. We've met the Dharma, and now you can practice it. So give value to your time. Don't kill your time. Give it value. As I said, it's an auspicious day, not because of the stars or anything else. It's auspicious because you are doing what you need to be doing right now, right now, with each moment. In other words, you're the one who makes it auspicious or inauspicious. So the choice is yours.